Hey guys, do you guys notice the difference? I got my new phone so you can see the better quality and today's video will be about the Gatling gun and so you know they're basically stronger archers I think but take a lot more troop space, they take 8 troop space um, they deal, make them, make infantry units deal half speed and half damage so hopefully that'll be good um, actually my first recording froze so I had to do it again um, it's not because of the phone bros, but like the, my internet had issues, so I was trying to like do an array, but I couldn't. And let's see. So my attack lineup today is going to be um, lancers, bombard, Gatling gun, and a couple infantry, just to fill up the the rest of it. Um, I hope that this raid even works. To be honest, I think it might do some decent damage. It'll probably be like medieval base, maybe gunpowder, but I just kind of want to show off. First looks with the Gatling gun. Okay, uh, what I should have done is just kind of let me just take out this easy base and then show you guys like how it looks like, and then we'll try to take out a harder base. Oh, so that's pretty nice. It looks so it looks so nice on my side. I hope it looks nice on your side. Oh my gosh, you see, you see that? Destroying those troops. Destroying them. So I don't actually have to worry about that Coliseum. I do have to worry about these these troops taking out my Oh my gosh, they Oh wait, they actually do a lot more damage than I think because it does it in like bursts. So they actually do a lot of damage. I might actually try an all Gatling raid then. That might be pretty nice. Uh, also, it might be just because my bomb bar was behind them, but I mean, it still, to me, it did a lot of damage, so. Okay, I think I lost one Lancer so far. It's not bad. They're definitely doing a lot of damage to these uh, infantry troops. If you guys see them, they're doing a lot of damage. It's really nice. And they kind of do, like, burst burst uh, attacks, so. Let's see. Let's focus on the Gatling guns over here. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, there's definitely, like, this will probably, the Gatling guns will probably be really good in, against, like, the Lightman Age bases because the garrisons and, like, stables produce so fast that you need something to, like, counteract it, and so the Gatling gun will, will do that much, so. Let's see. Oh, I actually didn't lose any. Nice. Okay, so... That was just a basic. Now let's see if we can find a harder one. Um, let me get another armor blessing, just you know, just because. Actually, let me get a weapon blessing too, might as well. And let me see what that boosts our health and attack up to. So that boosts up to 2180 and 514 against defenders. Wow, it's pretty good stuff. Okay, let's let's get going. Let's see if we can find at least a gunpowder or just a harder one than a medieval one. I'm in the lower level ranks right now because, you know, I'm trying to get enough food for stuff. I mean, this is a gunpowder age, but it doesn't look that difficult. Huh. Let me get a little bit more difficult one, hopefully. Hopefully I just didn't pass over and then had to, like, that was just a good one to fight against. Yeah. Yeah, I'm in the medieval age. Uh, I mean, I'm in the... 600s ish so that means I'm gonna get easier opponents yeah but hope I can find just a decent one okay guys uh, let me see now are you guys enjoying the Gatling gun though maybe do you guys what would you guys like to see an all Gatling raid uh, hopefully I have enough oil for that because oil takes freaking forever to produce and most people do don't even have an oil well yet so when you raid somebody like, you know, hopefully they have it, but they don't, so. Okay, this is level 76. Let's just try this one. Okay, so. Let's see, the best position to attack from. Mm hmm. I think we're gonna attack from this Coliseum over here and then try to take out this Ballista Tower, uh, this cannon right here. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put out all the. Lancers first, send up the bombards, send up the Gatling guns, and just send up these two infantry units.
Wait, I think the Gatling... Oh, I don't know if that was a bomb bar. The Gatling gun just attacked over the wall. I don't think they can. Yeah, they can. They can attack over the wall. Wow, they have, most, they have pretty good range then. Um, let's see. Oh, watch out, Bombard. Okay, good. Good, good. The Gatling guns definitely do, like, a lot of great damage to, like, their troops, so. And they attack anything, really, so. Kind of helps out. We should worry about this Ballista Tower right here. Oh no, that's bad. No, my Bombard. That's a bad idea. I lost, let's see, both my Bombards, my Infantry Units, uh, my Fusilers, and two Gatling Guns. No, one Gatling Gun can take on multiple troops by themselves, so that's really good. And they can attack over walls. Their range must be quite long, because they're attacking that tower unit over, over the wall, like from a distance too, so. Stop attacking, oh. Oh my gosh, did you see that? That just destroyed all those troops by them, like six troops by himself. Oh my gosh. Yep, uh, for the most part, I think, I, I think if I had a better strategy or more Gatling guns maybe, that actually might be a good, a great strategy to have. These Bombards actually, they're helpful, but not as helpful as they used to be, I think. Okay. Um. They're going for that tower. He's attacking the food. I think I'm also not rally them together. But did you, I think you guys got a good look at just how the how good these Gatling guns are against troops. Okay. Kind of wish we had a speed up button, you know, so I don't have to waste your last 49 seconds because you know I didn't win this one, like five star, but I did like two star, it. so. It's not the worst thing. Anyways, guys, um, hopefully I can try to upgrade upgrade my factory so I can get the gorilla. So I want to show that off too. Um, I I need like 2700 20 uh 2700000 um, food. I think I can get that. I just need some time because I have work and you know that just takes up a lot of time so hopefully I can you know ha make time to earn the food and stuff so then I can upgrade that's the bad thing about getting up to like the enlightenment age and like industrial age and stuff eventually it just costs too much and you don't not everyone has the time to like go do those kind of things I think a good combination would just be lancers and gatling guns because the gatling guns would take care of the troops and the lancers would take care of the defensive buildings Anyways, I wanted to show you, it's actually 2,500,000, so we can actually get the Gorilla, and so the, actually, I wonder if this would be a good combination, like, the Gorillas with the Gatling Guns together, because the Gorillas would take out the buildings, and the Gatling Guns would take out the troops. Hmm. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, let me know what you guys think about the Gatling Gun, and I'll see you guys next time.